Welcome guys! Do you want to learn some nice spots and strats from the real pros? Then you're at the right place. Every week I upload a new Rainbow Six Siege guide or Pro League breakdown. And today I will show you some awesome tips from the Pro League match between Most Wanted and Flipside that you can start using yourself to win more matches. I really hope that you enjoy my videos, that you learn some from the new spots and strats that you can start using right away. My most watched video right now have almost 800 likes. Can we break that record on this one? If you like the video, don't forget to show it by hitting like here below so we can set a new channel record. Also, since this is a weekly series, don't forget to hit subscribe below so you don't miss any of the upcoming guides just like this one. So, let's get straight into tip number one. We are going to have Zilchi here now. Zilchi had a wonderful C C4 throw previously. He's looking to get it again. He's trying, he's going to toss it up, blow it up, and nothing will hit just yet. This was such a smart play. Sitting down in the arsenal room, he had this one reinforced, so he's covered behind here. He had opened up this hole here. He was sitting with the scanner, waiting for the attackers to come out from kitchen here. And as soon as he sees them, just blow them up. Here you can see where it exploded. So you usually have attackers coming exactly here because they are coming through the kitchen and you usually have Buck or Sledge trying to open it up. Get some angles in here, opening up over here. And usually also Fuse will try to get Fuse down for example here. So this is a perfect spot to, to just wait for them to, to try to enter here and just as soon as, as soon as you see them, just throw it up and blow them apart where the defenders are starting, but when it gets to the end of the round, you're going to get that information on what holes are opened, you're going to see where they're being held from, and it's, it's one of those things that is underused by many teams, and the pro, t the pro teams here I highlight that. Right. I was thinking we might actually see some contention from Mute into... Most Wanted really did not want Flipside to enter through the escape tunnel. They had a Jagger device here, they had the Mutes, and they had a shield to protect. So if, for example, Flipside did not bring a Thatcher, the only way to get in here is to throw a grenade in through here. Then you had first the Jagger device to collect them, and also if they continue to throw after that, the shield will also protect the Mute Chargers here from another one. So this way, unless they spent hell of a lot of grenades, they will not get in. In this example, the Mute Jammer was a bit misplaced, so he could get the explosion up right here in the corner so they got in but very smart way to deny a uh, team the, the escape tunnel if they don't bring Thatcher. Who knows all the same Mint bandit tricking that wall helping out his team denying most wanted their line of sight that they This was a shield that they used time and time again just place it down here in the arsenal room and they play with Rook here keeping an eye on the hallway here waiting for them to pass here. This is how it looks for the attackers coming in and the beauty with this shield is also that you have of course this angle in here but since I can't see through this one you can also for example go here and change the, your angle so when they are coming in they can't be sure that you are they need to keep an eye on, on two angles where you can pop up so very nice. Flank and not expose yourself unnecessarily, and unfortunately he did just that. We are seeing, ladies and gentlemen, this a cash room server room hold. When have you seen this before, Bloodbath? Once. once. I saw it once with Continuum. Continuum tried this season three. They, they, they did not, uh, they unfortunately did not get it to be successful, I think but this it was, was super close. Yeah, I think yeah, it was pre-Mira, and yes. the, way, the way they were trying to do it was from C4 and from underneath. That was their strategy, just C4. C4 from underneath, make sure that garage has, they still have access via garage. Right. But what they're, what they're seeing here now is a great mirror placement. All yeah. they need to do is maintain control of the stairs. So this is the philosophy of, okay, we've got a new operator, Mira. She does something special and new, and let's see if it can work to make a site that was previously not viable, viable. This is something you don't see every day. They actually picked cash. Uh, this is the hardest site to defend, according to me, and you almost never see this objective play in the Pro League. But they did this as a surprise to, and tried some new strats with Mira, and it actually worked. So what they had was, they had a shield here also, 
So the rotation was a bit protected if they need to go out. They had a Mira in here. And they had been forced here and was holding the garage. Then they also out here had the middle one reinforced with the Mira. Just trying to deny them anything here. And they played, as they play in the garage, they play to deny the stairs so they can't come up here and, and get in the back. So what they're trying to do is trying to tunnel them to make sure that they came through this wall or window or f from the west side, so to say. And it actually worked for them. So if you're going to hold cash, <laughs> I would still not recommend it. But if you're going to hold cash, try this one. It's also a very smart strat and it worked beautiful for them. Gurmy's gonna tuck himself back into the strip club. Mint's moving on forward. Now, he's just gotta spend some time finding out where that's gonna be. Now, Gurmy, all he has to do is hold a soft angle, wait for Mint to go, and that's what he's doing. He's holding a soft angle. There's probably a drone that's actually gonna tell him, yes, he's pushing for you. He's gonna hold it high up right on the other side. He doesn't have enough time. He's gotta go for the destruction now. Oh, as much as he sees him, he's oh! gonna get it. He's gotta turn he around. Doesn't have time. He, he does no. not have enough time. He got the oh, kills. Mints. He got it, but that was a very well played job. This is something more players should learn from the pros. Play time. In this case, the defuser was down. The defender didn't know where he was. So he just stayed put, stay hidden, stay out of sight. This way, the defender was trying to find him and the, t the time just ran out because he had to have time to get the defuser. So play it safe don't challenge him don't peek them play time and just keep an eye make sure he doesn't get to the user they're coming through delivery trying to open up those walls and push their way directly into kitchen well, the vertical play always make the life rough for the other team so in this case you they're coming in zone, here you and you see up you straight up here this is a drum back. they had this hole so they can keep an eye on everybody trying to get in through this door or coming here for the delivery because they were defending down the kitchen and a lot a lot of teams try to push this way they use mountain they just push their way straight into be here so with this hole makes it much harder for the attackers coming in and then they also had another one because this one was castled off and then they had another hole here right on top of the door here you can see the holes see next to this one this is the door that they had castled so they can just wait for them to come through this door and the other one was right here under this here you can sit and wait for them to get through here i mean still plenty of time in the round here for most wanted to try to get it back in their favor but right now with flipside having as much utility as they still have left on them opening up that wall in the kitchen realize down here in the restaurant, you have probably the best anchor position on this map. You can play down here, keep an eye on stairs, keep an eye on the rotations, and you're protected. You have walls all around you and a lot of cover here, so this is an excellent anchor position. What they did here was place a shield also, so make this position even more flexible. Because in this case, for example, he was laying down here, protecting this window, and if they come down these stairs. So this way, this position with this shield, this position is much more flexible and can can defend both ways. That's it for this time. I really hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, don't forget to hit subscribe and like here below. You can also find links where you can find me on social media in the description. And I will see you next week when I'm back with a new video.